Hi guys, what's up? It's your girl Hattie. Welcome back to my channel. I'm here with another mukbang and this time this is a Zaxby's Cobb chicken salad, grilled chicken salad mukbang. Okay, so let's get into it. If you're new to this station, I love to sing my grace and if you've been coming, thank you so much for the support. Please continue to come. Let's get into it. Forward great and forward good and we thank thee for our food by thine hands most to be fed give us lord our daily bread give us lord our daily bread amen thank you guys so much so let's get into it Go ahead and put my sauce on here. I got ranch. Normally, I would get either ranch or Mediterranean from there. But today, I was in the mood for ranch. So, I got some ranch salad dressing. How are you guys doing today or tonight? Whatever you're watching me. It is very rainy here today in Alabama. If this is your first time coming, where are you from? <laughs> there is a comment section where you can put that. All right. dressing. I have the coldest water bottle in the building as it is on Be Love's Life channel. Let's get into it guys. Let me mix this together a little bit. I want to have it so sectioned off. And I love an egg y'all. They put eggs in here. I like their cob salad because it has eggs. I love eggs in my salad. If you're gonna do it, do it big. Let's cut that up a little bit. Put that egg on up and mix it up in there. All right. Let me move my bread out the way because y'all know I don't eat bread for real, for real. <laughs> Okay, I know y'all like, go ahead and eat, girl. You taking too long. Eat. <laughs> Let me eat then. Let me shut up and eat. Mmm. Mmm. -mm. So I'm eating a salad. So I ate a little something for lunch already at work. <laughs> so I didn't want to just be eating too much all through the day. So I was like, let me give me a nice salad. Because McDonald's and Burger King, where I work, or close to where I work, or maybe all of them, I'm not sure. But during this pandemic, they don't have salad. So I couldn't get a salad from them. But that's okay. I got some other stuff, so I was straight. I was straight to hold me into now. A little nugget won't hurt every now and then, huh? <laughs> okay, guys, in this salad there is cheese. Bacon, eggs, cucumbers. I'm sure some of y'all have had this before. Most of y'all have had this before. If you're a salad person, I am. 
Mm. <laughs> you know what I should have got? But I'll get it. <laughs> I'm going to do that challenge, that other challenge we love did recently that I talked about on, um, I think, my last what bang or the one before that but i'm gonna do it mm. Mm -mm. yeah i tried some jalapeno poppers no, jalapeno bites, cheese bites from Burger King. They were so good. Now, I'm not even into those like that, but something's like trying. I know I like jalapenos on nacho cheese, like nachos and cheese and all that stuff. You get the jalapenos on top. Mm -mm. Try those bites from Burger King. They're good. Mm Then like some good old cold, ice cold water. <laughs> mm, 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 mm. I'm sorry, I'm just be dancing. Sorry, not sorry. Who else dance when they're eating? Get excited about food when it's good. You get what you have paid for. And was it? Mm.
how are you feeling today? Today or tonight, I have whenever it is for you. At this moment, how are you feeling? What's on your mind? <laughs> like I tell y'all, if y'all have something y'all want to talk about with me, put it in the comment section. I'll answer it. If you have any requests, let me know. Mm -mm. Oh, excuse me. I'm just burping and going. So guys, I didn't talk that much during this mukbang because this food was too good. <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to catch myself. <laughs> I'm like, girl, you're not even talking. You know how you get down to that good ending? I'm sorry. <laughs> First bite? Well, there you go. And I ain't did no thumbnail or nothing. Let's see here. Try that again, y'all. Just make sure I don't have no food in my teeth. It's not very appealing. <laughs> All right.
and we are almost done guys <laughs> Just like that, we are done. <laughs> mm -hmm. They didn't toast it as much as they normally do, but it's good. It's good and buttery. I just don't eat a lot of bread. That was a treat. Nope. <laughs> you know how when you ate cheese toast as a kid or even when you eat cheese toast now, you want to eat the part that has the cheese on it? Yeah. It just That's what that butter just reminded me of. When I was a kid and all I wanted to eat was the little cheese part of the cheese toast. You bite the bread that has the cheese on top of it. Sometimes I used to throw the rim away and be like, okay, I'm done. to share with y'all but let me tell y'all about this water coldest water bottle today sorry i keep moving I'm moving now sorry <laughs> moving the camera and stuff okay so i was at work today and i caught myself going to re-up on my water drink a whole bunch of water so we get off work and it's already flooded outside so i had to take the longest way on the interstate home because the streets that i was going through downtown were flooded and when i'm talking about flooded i mean like even okay taller trucks suvs and transfer trucks were taking their time so the car in front of me and myself we end up hitting a u-turn and going back toward the interstate to get on the interstate because we were trying to catch the other interstate on the other end sorry hands everywhere <laughs> but anyway so as i get on the interstate and i'm headed home i'm like okay traffic isn't that bad on this side you know on the other side going toward um the other side of mobile like daphne over into daphne across the bay it was packed but on the side that i was traveling on it was not it was going slow going at a moderate speed well it was it was bare let me say that it was going at a nice speed on my side so we get to another part where we're i'm really headed toward home as you merge off onto another part of the interstate it gets totally backed up. So I try to get in the lane closest toward the exit. Oh my goodness, I had to urinate so bad. Oh my God, okay. Y'all, I ain't know what to do. I couldn't even think straight. It was like all the water. I had just drunk a whole thing of this and it was just sitting on my bladder. It was water and it was just sitting on my bladder. I was like, and I had sips no, I had actually a drink from a Sprite, the Sprite Zero from McDonald's that I had just drank. And I was like, okay, I'm going to chase it down with some water because normally I'm not a drink person. I'm normally into water, but I didn't want to have to get a drink that had sugar in it. So I decided to get Sprite or whatever. So anyway, long story short, guys, I had to urinate so bad. Have you ever been to the point where you just had to go so bad? I had to hurry up and get to the nearest. I was trying to stop at a gas station. Every time I got ready to get to a gas station, it was like 
buku of people or either somebody was pulled over because their car wasn't doing well in the water or there was a utility truck trying to turn our power back on because as y'all know we had a tropical storm that came through here last night and so by the time i got onto a main highway i saw a cvs close to where i used to work oh my gosh all i could get out and do was say excuse me where is your restroom <laughs> I had to hear this so bad. Okay, that's my little story for today to share with you. Like, oh my goodness, I have never had to urinate so bad. I couldn't even think straight. I was like, oh my God, is this going to be the time that I actually urine on myself? You know how older people get older and they're like, okay, you had it one time where you have to go so bad that you can't hold yourself. I was like, oh my God, no, I am 30 something years old. I cannot sit here and use it on myself. <laughs> so thank God he kept me through that. I did not have to use it on myself. I had a CVS to rely on. But anyway. Anyway, that's enough about me. I hope you guys had a great day. Go ahead and subscribe, like, share, comment, tap the bell for notifications of the next time I post. I post Monday through Friday, four to six times a week. And if there's anything that you want to say to me, put it in the comment section. I'll be glad to answer that. Or, you know, if it's a challenge that you're trying to get me to do, or if it's something that you want me to eat, let me know. And yeah, let's go ahead and end this thing. Without further ado, peace, love, and happiness, blessings to you and me. Bye. Mwah.